Me. From the moment the dark titan Sargeras plunged his colossal blade into our world, crucial events were set in motion. Magni Bronzebeard heard the cries of Azeroth, giving up everything to answer her call. Since being wounded by the Mad Titan, Azeroth has been crying out in pain. As her dutiful speaker, he rallied the champions to her aid, and ultimately to confront the return of the old god, Nizar. It was during this conflict that Zalatath, a mysterious entity of the Void, made a deal with Nizoth, freeing her from the cursed blade that bound her essence within. Honor our bargain. Free me to find my own fate. After she vanished into the darkness, Nizoth was confronted by the mortal champions and destroyed, ending the old god's reign of terror. But they were not the only malevolent force with its eyes set on Azeroth. Soon, the sky was sundered, the Shadowlands split open, and our heroes were pulled into the realm of death itself. Go, champion! Go! It was there that Anduin Rin endured the worst. Captured, tortured, and through dark domination magics, forced to commit terrible acts against his will. I'm afraid that if I call on the light, it won't answer. Scarred and shaken by his experience, he vanished, his whereabouts unknown. After the threat of the Shadowlands had been quelled, the dragons of Azeroth returned to their ancestral homeland. It was here that the primal dragon, Iridicron, broke free of his prison and in pursuit of vengeance upon the titans who he felt had stolen our world, he secured an ancient powerful artifact, the Dark Heart. When the Titans come to reclaim their prize, I will be waiting. As word of this new threat started to spread, people began experiencing strange visions. The Radiant Song is being heard all across Azeroth. The Council doesn't know what to make of it. It was then that Illyria Windrunner, a deadly huntress who had harnessed the powers of the Void as a weapon against the darkness, was summoned to investigate. We still don't know what this dark heart relic is capable of, but we do know it's in the hands of someone called the Harbinger. It was not long before Illyria discovered the Harbinger's true identity. Zalatath. The mysterious figure was once again on the move. While neither Zalatath nor the Dark Heart could be found, her mentor, the enigmatic Locus Walker, issued Illyria a dire warning. The radiant visions you spoke of are the very same my people had before our world was consumed by the Void Lord Dementius. Could Zalatath be seeking that same fate for Azeroth? You must find a way to stop her. If you cannot, then Azeroth is already doomed. <laughs>